Hello and welcome to the fourth lesson of the professional advertising course. In today's lesson, we will learn how to make this design right here. So let's begin. First, we select the proper background of our design. And I have chosen this one here. We add it to the Photoshop. Now we adjust it. Now we add the image of the cat. This one right here. I add it to the Photoshop. I add it to the design page. Oh, first I have to crop it, sorry. If you have an image with a white background, there is no need to crop it with this tool right here. All you have to do is go here and press the let in your keyboard. Like this. There is still some between the cat legs that I need to delete. I zoom in and I select it like this and delete from the keyboard as we said earlier right there right here and a little bit in here this right here I will delete it with this tool so I have to grab it like this like this and it's gone now I add it to the design page I adjust the size now I flip it I go here to edit to transform and as you see I can rotate it 180 degree 90 degree 90 degree counterclockwise but for me I rather another way there is another way I go here and I select this box here then I flip it like this it's much easier As you see now, the cat image looks not in the track, so I have to make it on the track as one of the horses. Now I have to crop this part here of the fence. I zoom in, I go here, I select it. Now the objective here is to make the cat 
Looks like it's racing the, the other horses. Then right click and I go here. That's good. Oh, sorry. The, the, the cat layer was copied. Now I have to undo in here. I press on the layer here. Right click and I press layer via copy. And it's ready. And as you see, the cat looks behind the fence. Now I have to delete the horse feet. This one here and here. I'll show you how to do that. I go to this tool here. Now to do that I have to press Alt and the left mouse so you have to press them both at the same time alt and the left button of the mouse and as you go as I said alt and the right oh sorry the left mouse button alt and the left mouse button at the same time I go until they disappear. I keep doing this until a whole feed disappears. Now it's all gone. Well, there is still some left over that I need to delete so I zoom in and I delete it like this now I have to adjust the cat color I go here to image adjustment saturation Again, I go to image adjustments to levels. Now, as you see, the cat tail is very large, so I need to adjust it. like this
Now I will add the jockey on top of the cat. I've chosen this picture right here. I add it to the Photoshop. First, I, I need to add this sheet number here. I add it to the Photoshop. Then I crop it. Now I add it to the design page. First I need to add the remainings of the leg here, of course. As I showed you earlier, we choose this tool, then we go right here. Alt and the left mouse button together at the same time alt on the left mouse button Now it's ready. I add it to the design page and I add it on top of the cat. I adjust it to look generally on top of the cat. Now I will add the jockey. This is the image right here I added to the Photoshop. 
Then I grab the jockey. I need to be careful on the edges so that we don't leave any leftovers. Zoom in on the image when you want to crop it so that it makes it easier on you. Just a reminder, these courses right here, these lessons right here, are not for beginners. You need to be at least familiar with the Photoshop tools. But if you know, you think that uh, you can work or design posters like this without knowing the tools just by following, that's good. Just follow what I do exactly and do it like, do it the same, and you'll be fine. But I strongly advise to know the tools of Photoshop to make things easier for you. I flip the jug image like this. I make it look like it's sitting on the cat. Now we will add the bridle. I already cropped the bridle. Now you can choose any bridle you want. But I already cropped this to save time. Now I add it to the Photoshop. And I add it to the design page. I need to add this left over right here, like this, and here too. So that it appears that the jockey holding the bridle. I'll crop this little space right here. You need to be very careful with this and pay attention to details. Now we're good. Now we will add the shadow to the cat. I select the, the layer, I copy it, then I go to edit, 
transform to flip vertical and I adjust it like this Now I adjust it like this. Then right click on the mouse and go to Blending. And I go to Color Overlay. Then I choose the black color like this. Then I go here and I go to Filter, Blur, Blur again. to gush and blow like this I open a new layer I choose this tool the black color I zoom in a little bit then like this now we only have one more effect to it We go to the background, I copy it like this, then I go to filter, blur, motion blur, so that we make that the, the horses are moving or speeding. I chose minus two, but you can choose whatever setting you see fit. Whatever settings you deem to be fit, you can work with them. Now I choose the eraser tool, like this. And I erase in here. That's good. Now I will copy the cat layer again and I go to here filter, blur, motion blur. That's okay, that's good. Then I put it on top here. And I do the same things that I did to the horses to the cap. like this same to the jockey copy I go to filter, blur, motion blur like this
Now this is the final look of our design. A design like this you can use it to promote whatever products concern cats like cat food, cat clothes and everything. Anything related to cats. One more thing, I'm only showing you how to create an ad. So you can do whatever you want and create a different ad to use it to your own benefits. Now I will see you on the next lesson. Thank you very much.